hello 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 and welcome back to plans on planning here we are in my um personal planner um that was my beautiful <laughs> monthly spread that you guys helped me to create but this is the week that just passed as you can see it was pretty boring and kind of relaxed and i totally loved it but it's time for us to prep for the new week which is actually the last full week of september and then we're in to October. Tell me how crazy is that? September is over and done with. Like, I truthfully cannot believe it. Time is totally flying. I don't know what I'm going to do with my life. Because it's about to be pumpkin spice season. And oh my gosh, when I tell you, I just absolutely, positively, 100% love pumpkin spice season and just all the baking because I'm a huge baker. Um, I just love to bake, bake, bake and I love pumpkin spice season because I love to bake things with pumpkin spice and pumpkin puree and all that wonderful stuff. But anyway, we're talking about planning now and not pumpkin spice, even though we probably should talk about pumpkin spice, but okay, let's focus. All right, so here is the washi that I'm using today and that is because, I think I'm gonna roll away. Okay, so that's the washi that's going to roll regardless of how I put it. What the heck? Am I on a slant or something? Like, All right, let's just do that. All right, so that's the washi I'm using because I am using this layout. So I thought it worked basically perfect. Look, look, look at that. Look at that. I mean, this doesn't just happen by chance. Like, this is work that I put in to get these colors to match in such a fashion. Oh, my goodness. I'm good. I mean, I'm good. All right. I'm, like, seriously, I'm good. So, let's go ahead and get started. And you know what that means. We're going to go ahead and get rid of this September. Move that out the way. Let's get September missing and I just nicely white it out no pressure no nothing there we go um me patting it down is just to make sure it is completely flush to the page if you work with white out tape you know it is fickle at times and basically does what it wants to do so back to the washi this is going to of course be my border washi and this is going to be my supporting actor and it's going to frame out our days bam so now this washi besides the beautiful uh flowers on it also says some wonderful things so many reasons to be happy and because it's going a certain way, I can't manipulate the washi, so I'm going to manipulate the book. So I'm just going to go ahead and flip this around, which makes it just so much easier to work with. And then I'm going to try my best to get, gracious, as much of the wording as possible. So I'm going to bring it straight to the corner because I'm trying to get... All right, so let's do it like this. So unfortunately, I'm going to lose this here for the banner part, but the way it actually cuts off, I can use it down in the note section, which I think is going to be pretty awesome. So what I'm doing is I am measuring out where I can get this whole, where I can get this whole thing, this whole portion off, you know, clean break type thing. So I'm measuring the end of it. Because if the flower gets cut, the flower gets cut. No bad blood between me and the flower. There we go. Bam. And then with my handy dandy scissors, I'm just gonna go ahead and cut this. All right, and like I said, I'm going to use it at the bottom of the page um, in the notes area, but not right now. So I'm just going to put it over to the side uh, to use it on a little bit later. And then we're going to go ahead and go to the second side of the page. And like I said, we're trying to get it as wonderful as possible. And it kind of doesn't work on this end without cutting it off again. So... 
we're gonna cut it off again. Why? Because we got it like that. But this time, I'm actually going to cut it, to be honest. Just because it makes it so much easier on my knife. So snip, snip. Snip, snip, boo boo. And then I'm going to just start in the corner, just pressing it down lightly and then working outward. And see this little ripple here? I don't know if you can tell, but there's a little ripple here. And that's why we press lightly. So we can go ahead and just lift it up and smooth it out. That's a perfect example of why I, why I press lightly. Because I'm just pressing enough to hold it to the page so I can keep on moving. Not enough to necessarily stick to the page. Then I go back and I reinforce the stick. Now... Because of where it is, I'm just going to go ahead and use my scissors to give it a little snip snip. And we are good to go. So, that's what we have to work with on the top. Now, it looks beautiful. It's so cute. Oh my gosh. Alright, now here's the supporting actor of this theatrical engagement. And this is what we're going to use to frame out our days. Bam. Um, it's just cute little hearts, blue and foiled. I just think it's adorbs. And it totally works with um, what we're using for the stickers, which, of course, is the best part. Bam. There we go. There we go. Like how wonderful, like the colors are working out. Oh, for whatever reason, that's not sticking. That's super weird. Okay. And just keep it moving. Like, even though it's not 100% finished, like, you can just really see everything coming together. And I love that part of this. Just little by little, everything starts to look so pretty and completed. And all you can see how the colors really work together. It's like, oh, my gosh. What? Oh, I ran out of washi. Oh, my goodness. So, like, I literally ran out of washi. If you can tell, like, it's light and then dark. That means the washi is over and done with. And there's no way to get this brown paper off. So, this last line, we're just unfortunately going to be without. Like, has this ever happened to you? This is maybe, like, my first time running out of washi. This is such a sad moment in my life. Oh my gosh. What what do I do? Like do you have a funeral for your washing? Is that what's supposed to happen? Because I feel like we should pay some type of respect. So let me just put this to the side. Get a program together and we're going to honor the washi in some special way. Alright, but back to business at hand. So as you can see, it did come together very lovely and it's beautiful and it's nice. Um, because it is the sticker portion of this event, we do have some supporting washi that I still want to add, which is the two pieces that we use from the top. And I'm going to cut this off just like that. And I'm going to put it up here on this side. And then for the second one that we have, I'm actually going to leave it on that time 
and I'm going to put it on the bottom half of the page. Or maybe, actually I'm gonna cut it, just so the sizing is the same. It's freaking me out, the sizes were different. Sorry. So, now we're gonna put it on, and on the bottom portion of the page. Bam. Ha ha ha. And, probably gonna add some little dots. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, it's gonna be fabulous, it's gonna be fabulous. It's gonna be awesome, it's gonna be wonderful. I cannot wait. All right, so let me get my sticker book out. So here we go. Here are the stickers that we're working with. Um, our color story, it's gonna be really cute. Let me move my scissors over to the side and let's get started. So um, if this is your first time joining, uh, here's the stickers from the 365 Create sticker. I call them color stories. I don't necessarily know like the official name of it because it just says stickers, but I call them color stories. Now, three, Create 365 is made for the Happy Planner layout. Clearly, I do not have a Happy Planner or use the Happy Planner layout. Um, so, I have to tweak the stickers just a tad to still make them work how I need them to. And I do that by starting from the bottom and going up. Oh, I like focus better. Sorry. Wait, I want this. Don't forget. I know I usually just work one side at a time, but I do want this. Don't forget up here. Bam. Now, in this area and why I chose focus over don't forget is because I like to put something um, a little inspirational, a wonderful little reminder. I mean, whether it's just like you're beautiful in this area. Um... I think I want this because it has stripes. Oh, that is super crooked. Like, super crooked. All right, fabulous. Like even though you have like all the lines in the world, things still come out crooked. Explain that to me. All right, fabulous. I'm going to do a little inspo. And I think it's the way I'm lifting the sticker up off the page that's causing Actually, I'm going to put this and then this cute little important fabulous. And then I'm going to put this one on this side. So we have the weekend adventure to mark our, our fabulous weekend. We have a little inspo for our weekly goal. Um, this says live life happy. So I'm going to put that as a cute little reminder for a Monday. This says, you've got this, which I think is great for a Thursday. Thursday is kind of when I hit a slump, where I'm kind of like, ugh. It says, be always joyful. Make today awesome. And this says, special day. So you know that's a Friday. Hello. This I'm going to put on a Saturday because it says real life. Because Saturday is just full of like 
so much like the errands that you have to run all that stuff i'm gonna add goals to wednesday and then jot it down here on sunday because every now and then well not every now and then like i always forget just to write things down period so right now um I want to put this on a Monday, to be honest. So I'm working on not only having the idea, but writing the idea down. Because that is super important. Alright, so. We're going to cut this. Oops. To make sure it fits to what we need it. So I just cut it in threes and twos. Bam. So I'm going to get a three going on here. And I'm going to put two here. Right onto the right now. That worked out perfectly. There's a couple more hearts. Break it down into three and two. I'm going to put two goals here. And then three for here to add to my you got this and then umas some cute little circles for my thursday and friday i mean my friday and saturday so actually this would be a great three so just start writing stuff down and then two bam now when I was telling you, I'm just going to put some little dots going on here. These are the dots that I was talking about using. So just a little bit of everything in this area. Just to make it as cute and pretty as possible. Which I normally don't jazz up this bottom half. But let's do something different. Let's get crazy. And as you can see why, these stickers are super small, so placing them is a pain in the baton, behind, in the batukis, but we made it. And that's the important part. Ha ha ha. We made it. All right. So, here we are with our spread. It looks wonderful. It looks fabulous. I thank you ever so much for joining me and getting my week together on my week in order. Um, please feel free to leave a comment below. Um, any questions, comments, concerns, constructive criticism, I'm all there for it. Let me know what you thought, what you liked, what you didn't like, and we can talk about it. Um, if you feel more comfortable discussing things with me through email, you can definitely shoot me an email. I check my email like all the time, so I'll definitely hit you back. Do not forget to follow me on social media. And then, you know, slide in my DMs and let me know you saw the video and we can get to chit-chatting about that. But other than that, we are done. I thank you for joining me and I will see you later days. Mm -hmm.